My name is Maxine Doyle. I'm a UK-based choreographer and director. I'm currently making a work for Netherlands Dance Theatre 2 in collaboration with Cassie Kinoshi, who's creating an original score for the work, Yuka Hisamatsu, who's creating an original lighting design and scenography, and Brechie van Balen, who's creating the costume design. I'm also privileged to work with Gabi Nankaville, who's been co-creating the choreography with me. I had the idea a, a, a long time ago, actually, as soon as um, Emily Molnar invited me to create a, a work for the company, um, I, 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 was, I was thinking what kind of conversation do I want to have with these dancers and um, how do I want to, how can I kind of create an environment on stage? Um, so actually Yuka and I began talking over six months ago and we created this kind of light sonography really. So we have these sort of sculptures, these lighting sort of sculptures and structures that, that give a sort of frame for the frame for the work. So when I arrived actually to begin the creation, that concept is already in place. Um, and I've been working with Cassie on and off for several months uh, to create the score, um, which is very rich and, and magical in some parts, epic in others, classical in some parts, rhythmical in others. It goes, it goes all over the place. I had a very clear concept for the sort of for the structure of the music for this work, not necessarily the content, but the structure and the feeling. Um, and one of the provocations I gave to Cassie was, can you write this kind of orchestral beginning that feels very epic and grand, but then can you, can we talk about like 15 one minute events? Um, which was, you know, interesting, but also a sort of a, a challenge. What can you say in a short amount of time? I mean, I'm always very inspired by the people that I'm in the room with, so I don't arrive with a movement language. Um, the, the joy for me is trying to um, elicit that from the bodies in front of me. Um, I, think, I think this group of um, young artists are really special, actually, because there's such, there's such a room of individuals. Um, the way they move, the way they look, um, their ideas about some, you know, some are quieter than others, some are more vocal than others, um, and so it's been it's been an interesting process trying trying to sort of understand that and to, trying to support that, trying to have a sense that everyone in the room feel is is kind of seen in the work, um, and they're amazing technicians actually. So that's I've been really enjoying that and digging into like the richness of their physical. Um, sensibility and I'm, I'm really excited to, to see them on stage. I mean I would like the audience to have some questions about this work. Um, it's a poetic work I think and it does deal with, it does contain narratives, uh, loose narratives and it does contain language. Um, I'd, I'd like to feel like the audience feel like they go on a kind of ride with the, on the kind of emotional journey of the work. Uh, and I'd like to feel that they are kind of drawn into its kind of potential magic and atmosphere. Yeah, I'm excited to share the work. I think, I think it's, you know, it's a piece that I hope perhaps makes us think about the world that we live in um, currently. I think it's a work which has a sense of emergency, it has a sort of sense of urgency at the heart of it. It's both magical and dramatic and I hope it makes us think about the things that are really important to us. So if we were, if we were faced, if we were put in a situation where um, it's the last 15 minutes before the world ends, what would you want to say? Where would you want to be? Who would you want to be with? Um, you know, we find ourselves faced kind of daily with a, a, a countdown to a global climate catastrophe. Some would say we're in the middle of that. Um, so I think this work is, I hope it's like a reminder of the things that are really important. Connection, uh, community, the natural world. Um, 
so I'm, I'm hoping that it will, it will, it's a sensory work that will create, you know, conversation.